Shipping is one of the oldest industries in the world. It is the backbone of international trade and cruise tourism is constantly increasing. As a transportation option, shipping is relatively efficient in terms of emitting climate gases. However, since most ships use heavy fuel oil, HFO, they emit more air pollution than other means of transport. HFO contains 3,500 times more sulfur than vehicle diesel, and using HFO releases many more harmful emissions into the air, including nitrogen oxides and fine toxic particles. In 1997, a game-changing international regulation, MARPOL Annex 6, designated the Baltic Sea a sulfur emission control area, gradually limiting ships to use fuels with a maximum of 0.1% sulfur. There are a couple of alternatives for complying with this regulation. Ships can install exhaust cleaning systems, often referred to as scrubbers. Ships can stop using HFO and switch to a much cleaner fuel or gas. Electric battery-powered batteries will also help to reduce emissions in the future. To make sure the regulation is followed, ships are being monitored in various ways. Officially, port state control inspectors check if individual vessels comply with the regulation, taking fuel samples if necessary. The results of the checks in the ports are often good, but some areas of the Baltic Sea are harder to monitor than others. One ingenious way of monitoring vessels out at sea is using a sniffer. In this instrument, the concentration of various pollutants in the ship's smoke is analysed. A sniffer can be installed in fixed and mobile stations alike. This is the most effective way to catch cheaters unawares. Thanks to Seeker, the Baltic Sea region is already benefiting from reduced pollutant emissions, better air quality and increased expertise in clean shipping solutions for the global maritime industry.